Right, so another alternative um, to all this kind of coronavirus um, panic buying type thing. Um, the only really decent alternative I could think of for toilet roll or toilet tissue, whatever you call it. Um, so obviously you would go from toilet tissue to kitchen roll, couldn't get kitchen roll, maybe kind of baby wipes and all those kind of things. If all of that was gone and you couldn't get nothing like that at all, then the only other thing I know is, if you want actual tissue, is normal paper, right? And you probably see enough people do these kind of videos, but this actually does work, 100%. Um, you get a normal sheet of paper, and this is like, you know, printer paper, and you scrunch it up, and you unroll it again. But what I'm going to do, I'll do that in fast forward, so you know, see how many times it takes to do it. But it does work, and it does make it really soft. So I'll start doing that now. Right, so, however many times that was, scrunched it up, rolled it up in your hand, and this is how it comes out. Now, that is soft. You wouldn't think it, that's very soft, and you could keep going. So, here's a piece of, that's a piece of kitchen roll, and that's a piece of normal paper which has been scrunched up. I've done another one here as well, which I've done a little bit more, just kept going, and that is actually... I don't know if you can tell, but that's really soft. And what you could probably do, maybe you could cut it into four and have four sheets per one, or cut it into two and have two sheets. But that is really soft. And it's just, just like tissue paper now. But that's the only way I could think of making kind of paper which was soft, like proper soft. And it, like I said, that's just as soft, if not... No, it almost feels softer than kitchen roll to be honest with you and that gives you you know you could do that it takes a little while to do but if you had time on your hands you could do it into four so you had four sheets that size but the more you do it and roll it in your hand the softer it becomes one thing I would say is though if you're going to do a lot of these I'd wear gloves because you'd be surprised in how much it wears on your hands and makes your hands feel sore. My hands, I don't even see that. They already look a little bit red from keep doing it. It's alright, you know, it's alright once you've got them soft, but at first it's quite hard paper. That's the only thing I could think of um, for an alternative actual soft paper for toilet roll. Um, one other idea. I thought of was an idea for free paper and that would be I don't know what other countries get this but go down Argos and get one of the Argos books if you get that you've got roughly 1694 sheets that you could scrunch up and make soft I did do one earlier on this stuff's thin so you could do it quite quickly You've got over a thousand sheets there. You don't have to scrunch it up, you could just use it like that. If not, give it a good scrunch up. This stuff seems to go soft pretty quickly. Even that's pretty soft now. It's a bit glossy, but, but that's the only way, simple way, I can see to make it kind of soft. You see that's a lot. Of, on a softer already. Do a few sheets of that in no time. Seems the thinner the paper, the quicker it is to do it. You can see that. So you don't want to, you know, it just flops now. Anyway, that's the second video of alternatives in this weird kind of time we're going through. Any others I think of, I'll let you know. And don't forget, I've got a new book out. It's called Coronavirus Survival Guide. It's on Amazon. 
four pound fifty. Um, basic guide, you know, good to take around you to remind you of certain things. To be honest, I'd written it a little while ago, but it took ages to get it published for some weird reason. I don't know whether it was because the, the title or the subject, but it took ages for it to be um, published. But normally, it's within 72 hours, this was nearly a week before it was even um, published. Anyway, check that out. Cheers for watching. I'll see you later.